Yo, what is up? Back to the Desert Family. So uh, the video you're about to watch is a really good one. It is from Thanksgiving 2019. We went to Glamis here in California. Had an amazing time given all the upsets that we had during our, our riding there. Um, There's some trials and tribulations and some really good people that helped me along the way. Um, I'd like to shout those people out now. We got Steve Sims, um, Junior Quintero. Uh, we got... Jimmy Zucone from Evolution Power Sports, and a gentleman by the, the name of Ian, um, that actually, you know, when we were out there, broke down, he helped me and my family, um, help us get back to, to camp safely. Um, we broke, we broke out at a swing set, and we, we parked at a, we were camped at Vendors Row. So it was very far away. Um, took us several hours to get back on three wheels, um, and we ended up on our side twice. So without further ado, uh, enjoy the video. Um, as you can tell in the video, I have a very heavy right foot. I like to go fast. Um, I try to be as safe as possible and, and I always look ahead. Um, some things you just can't avoid though. So enjoy the video. Peace. just stopped by Pearson's gas station in San Diego, Elkhorn Boulevard off the 15 to get E85. We got like 40 gallons, I think is what we got. So hopefully that lasts us four days. I'm thinking 10 gallons a day, something like that. Um, the car does have already 10 gallons in it, so it is full. So, and it's currently raining here in San Diego, but it's not raining in Glamis. So hopefully it's all good. Um, we're gonna take it nice and slow. Gotta get these kids there safely and uh, we'll see how it goes. So we made it safe and sound. About to go to, on our first ride, um, go see the Evo guys. Over here with Steve Sims from the uh, Can-Am Max page from Facebook. Uh, I camped right next to him. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go see what's cracking tonight. See if anything's going on.
supposed to be so I am checking crack pressure and uh, the crack pressure was I already said it I'll check here so the crack pressure was about nine and a half ten now it's at 11 so um, I'm gonna reset it and go do some more runs and see how she's running so I'm back at Evolution again. Uh, I like hanging out here so much. I got to do the clutch work. So on this one here, we're gonna pick the three um, that's like opposite of each other. We're gonna go here, here, and here. Um, and obviously we're gonna pick the ones that are the most accessible. So let's take those off and Okay, so when you tighten these, they do have nylock on them. Um, you don't need to go too tight. Just snug. And make sure it moves freely. And then, um, we're on the last one now. So I did this one. And then, you skip one, go to this guy, and skip another one. And do this guy. You can do this one right here. Super easy. I mean, it's like the easiest clutch job you could ever do. thing there just so it catches them gives it a chance but, uh, and then if it doesn't want to come out you just put a screwdriver in right here and give it a little a little opening a little leverage see how that popped off Thanksgiving night. Little underwater. People are still trying to come in. Yeah. Duffin 
not gonna ride tonight. It's still pretty early. I think it's like eight o'clock. So we're gonna call it night. Let this thing uh, bathe itself, and hopefully uh, some good riding tomorrow. Not that much mud. Friday morning. We're already riding like crazy. But as you can see behind me, it rained quite a bit last night. And, uh, With, with this uh, colder air. Oh, it's Black Friday, by the way. So go get your deals. But uh, the thing about this cold weather is more dense air. You know, help those intercoolers, help, help those turbochargers out a little more, make a little more, make a little, make a little more power. So uh, yeah, let's go get it. knuckle we're done uh axle yeah axle pulled out too god damn it all right let's try to limp her back home let's find a way you guys okay yeah. what's up guys what's up? you guys having fun yeah. are you yeah. the x3 is not Focus. Yeah, X3 is not having any fun. Three wheel motion.
Anyway, so we made it back. Um, pretty safe. I mean, we only got on the side twice. We only rolled over twice. Um, and some really cool, some some really cool people. This dude named Ian came and helped me out twice and helped me out. Um, but I'm going to go over to Evo right now because they said they have a hub for me. And Junior uh, Contero from uh, the Max page actually had these arms here. So I'm still gonna, I'm still missing the axle. But if we could get just that part going, we'd be solid. We'd, we'd be rolling again. Uh, and we could just do a rear-wheel drive, just two-wheel drive. So let's go over to Evo and, and see if they got it. Let's check it out. broke obviously and that guy's got a big old gaping hole in it uh, this one bent as well uh, so I got some some good used arms thanks to Junior and I got a hub thanks to Evolution Power Sports I'm gonna I don't think I'm gonna be able to get an axle in time but it's all good I'll, I'll roll with this thing three wheel drive it's all good as long as I'm rolling again barely Friday so this is progress so far. Um, I gotta find a, I think it's a 32 millimeter. But I gotta find a socket for that. So I get that hub to work. So we're still not out of the woods, but we'll get there. You sexy man, you. Steve for the rescue, you man. Handled, man. You paid for it, I delivered. Thank you, brother. Dude. A big box for an axle. Well, it's a big axle. This has been a big it's hassle. See, bud. I'll give it to your wife. Yeah, yeah, she's real happy about that. Dude. Hi, guys. How Thank are you, buddy. You? That's an axle. Um, I just sent coin my uh, credit card info and paid over the phone and it's service. Yeah. Let's get out there.
Well, we are out of here. We're all packed up. Shit, I wish that was mine back there, but no. This rig. Um, we're all packed up, heading back home to San Diego. Um, all in all, it was a great, great trip, even though we broke some stuff, and that was part of the fun, so. All right, see you back home. So long, Glamis. See you on New Year's.